Hello everyone, today we're diving into the realm of CPU cooling solutions, specifically tailored for the AMD Ryzen 7 7700X processor. With its high performance capabilities, keeping your Ryzen 7 7700X cool is essential for optimal performance. Stay tuned as we unveil our top 5 picks for the best CPU coolers in 2024, ensuring your Ryzen 7 7700X stays frosty under pressure. My name is Dan, and in this video, we're going to be looking at our brand new NH-U12A cooler, discussing what makes it so special, and comparing it to some of the other CPU coolers that we offer. As a general rule of thumb, the bigger a CPU cooler is, the better its cooling performance is. For example, our award-winning 140mm Dual Tower NHD15 is widely regarded as one of the best performing coolers on the market. However, such large coolers can sometimes cause compatibility concerns. For example, not all cases can accommodate such large coolers, and even when they can, these coolers will often overhang the RAM slots and the top PCIe slot, limiting you to standard hide RAM modules and forcing you to install expansion cards in lower PCI slots. This is exactly where the NHU12A steps in. By offering 140mm class performance in a 120mm size, it offers true top-end cooling without sacrificing compatibility. Firstly, like all of our 120mm tower coolers, it's only 158mm tall, around 7mm lower than most 140mm coolers, allowing it to fit into almost any modern tower case. Secondly, when designing the NHU-12A, we opted for an asymmetrical design that allows it to clear the RAM slots on LGA-1151 and AM4, enabling you to use any type of RAM that you like, regardless of how tall the modules are. And thirdly and finally, the NHU-12A measures only 125mm wide, which is 25mm less than bigger 140mm class coolers like the NHD15. As a result, it stays clear of the top PCIe slot on most ATX or micro ATX motherboards. Now of course, some of you may be wondering, how is this even possible? So allow me to briefly explain how we managed to achieve this. In short, there are three key features that allow the NHU-12A to significantly improve upon its predecessor and to rival some much larger coolers. The first cornerstone of the NHU-12A's superior performance is that we're now using seven heat pipes instead of five, which allows the heat to get from the CPU into the FinStack more efficiently. The second key point is that thanks to the asymmetrical design, we could increase the total fin surface area by around 37%, allowing for more efficient heat dissipation. And last but not least, we're using two of our latest state-of-the-art NFA12X25 fans in a push-pull dual fan configuration. This makes it possible to overcome the increased pressure drop caused by the larger fin stack, so we can get excellent results regardless of whether the fans are running at full tilt in a highly overclocked gaming rig or running at minimum revs in a near silent setup. So in a nutshell, all of this makes the NHU-12A a deluxe choice that combines top tier performance with excellent compatibility and outstanding quietness of operation.
As usual with the Dark Rock series, only our best fans are being used. Silent wings featuring the long-lasting fluid dynamic bearings and a smooth six-pole motor. The Dark Rock 4 uses one of these wonders and the Dark Rock Pro 4 even two with the one in the front sporting our famous funnel-shaped air inlets. And its heat pipes, playing a very important role in the cooling performance, have been reworked and are of even bigger quality now than before. If you're familiar with the Dark Rock series, then you will immediately notice the new matte finish. That's not just to make our designers happy, the new coolers are covered in a special coat of paint that comprises mostly of ceramic particles. While developing the new cooler using this coating resulted in a noticeably improved heat transfer, which makes it highly useful and not just a treat for the eyes. So let's go into the details. The new cooler fins are embossed throughout in order to increase the cooling surface. At the same time, they are wave contoured, which again is not just for the looks. We have tried a number of shapes and layouts until we have finally developed this form that uses air swirlings for additional cooling while minimizing noise emission. One additional detail with the Dark Rock Pro 4, a small gap in the cooling fins offers more room for the RAM bar. Finally, some will say, yes, we have heard you, both Dark Rock 4 and Dark Rock Pro 4 are now very easy to install from the upper side of the motherboard. And the Dark Rock Pro 4 features two classy heat pipe caps for that, which you will have to unscrew in order to install the cooler with a custom-made Be Quiet screwdriver included in the package. Speaking of things that are included, an extra pair of steel brackets give you the chance to install an additional fan in case you want to take the cooling performance to the extreme. Aside from the simplified installation process, we have also improved the silence and cooling performances. The Dark Rock 4 has a noticeably higher cooling performance than its predecessor and the Dark Rock Pro 4 has always excelled in this field so that we focused on lowering the noise output for the new model. Which, of course, we managed to achieve. To sum up, the Dark Rock series remains the undisputed air cooler champion, even more so with its new generation, regardless whether you prefer a single or a double tower design. If you enjoyed the video, please click the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel.